I decided to become a filmmaker um, because when I was younger, I used to write stories. I used to, like when I was in third grade, you would see me with a notebook and a piece of paper and I would just be writing stories, writing short stories, making characters and things of that nature. Then as I got older, um, I began to imagine my own little world. like. Everybody was a star in a TV show that I had written and created and directed myself. Um, then my mom bought me a book, actually bought me a book about the TV show Frasier. And in the back of it, it had the pilot script for Frasier. So I read the pilot script. I said I could do this and I began writing my own script. This was in 1998, I do believe. Um, I had all but forgotten about that until um, I saw Rent and watched Mark run around trying to make his documentary with his little 8mm camera. And I was like, huh, I want to try that again. So I got one of those little Sony digital, like those little hand camera, handy cams or whatever, um, that you get like $59 at Walmart or something. And I started running around with that. I still have it too. Um, and that was when YouTube started to be a thing. Um, so fast forward, daughter born. I went down the YouTube rabbit hole and woke up on the other side with FilmWrite blaring on television. Well, not television, but on my computer. And it inspired me to go back to my dream and pursue filmmaking again. So, here I am. Several episodes of FilmWrite and D for Darius and um, Tomorrow's Filmmaker and AI and Living Arts College years later. Um, and here is my demo reel from everything, well, both for in class and beyond that I've done so far in 2020. Enjoy. You only call me on the weekends when you're out and about. Only chasing highs, you need me. He brings me flowers on a Tuesday. He gives me good love and something that I never thought existed. I know what I need, ain't gonna lie. I know what I want, speak in my mind now. A queen needs a king to be by her side. Yeah. 